Hello and welcome back. Another week, another movie. Today, we've got a fun one in which I've been waiting. There's like three or four movies at the moment <laughs> that I have been waiting to come out or to be available to rent for a while or like when other movies haven't like come up and <laughs> today's is one of those. It's anyone but you. I don't really know anything about it. I know it's got Glenn Powell and Sydney Sweeney and it's, I think, a rom-com. I've just seen clips from... It just feels like it's going to be one of the... I think it did really well in the, like, cinema box office. <laughs> if you... If that, is that what it's called? Um, I don't know. I saw the trailer, like, a while ago. And I was like, this seems like a really fun, like, movie to just, like, watch and have fun with. Like, you know, sometimes we do a more serious... Like, last week it was, like, a very, like... Very thought. We've done a couple of like thought provoke poor things, and um, all of us strangers were very like thought provoking. I was like, this week a dumb rom com. It might not be like dumb, but like you know, like a cute, like fun. I will never knock. Or I love a rom com. I love getting into them, just having fun with it, seeing what's going on. Two very attractive people keeps <laughs> keeps me entertained. Like he, wow, like she, she's beautiful, but he is wow. Um. And yeah, that that is basically it. I'm like, it's. I think it's. I am going to assume, and from what I've seen from the trailer, it is friends or like family friends sh vacation on one side of the family, fake boyfriend girlfriend. They hate each other. Then they spend a lot of time with each other. They're misunderstood, and then they realize, oh, maybe when they pull back the layers and the layers of your clothes, you're really sexy, but also your brain's sexy, and I love you. I feel like it's gonna go down that line really fucking quickly. Well, not really. No, it's gonna go slowly, but it's I, it's a fun trope. It's a fun movie to do. I love watching, you know, when they go from the like, oh yeah, we're so in love. Get the fuck off me. Like that, that's just, it's, it's good and fun. And I hope it's going to be a really fun movie. Um, and that's basically it. That's my cell. I try to do a pinkish background for like love. Looks purple. Oh, you can barely tell. Looks pink in real life. Um, but other than that, we should just get into it. If you'd like to watch the full uh, movie along with me, uh, I have a link to my Patreon down below. Like and subscribe, that would be wonderful. And let's get into it. Establishments that serve food or drink must be open to the public regardless of their purchasing class. Oh, really? Let's see, can't really supersede state law. Amazing. Please, it's an emergency. Caramel latte for Miranda. That's me. I'm Miranda. Uh, honey, about to order. Do you want your usual? Oh wait, he's charming. Would like a double espresso. Although you've had trouble sleeping lately, right, babe? Maybe right, babe. Get off to a single. You kept. If someone did this for me, I would propose on the spot. Did didn't I? Yeah. So maybe I'll just have a peppermint tea with two sugars. Yes, this is husband. amazing. <laughs> Thanks, husband. Very normal. She's night. Nice. And she is part of the purchasing class, so can we get the bathroom key? Oh my god. This is good. This is so fun. I thought they were going to meant to hate each other. What's the ha what's the hap? Oh no. This is the time that I'm supposed to be meeting people. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god. I was like, why are you holding this thing? Well. And you don't have your coat. I love it how he's overthinking. Honestly, you have pretty privilege here, babe. I'm just going to say that right now. You walk out, just own that shit. He is not going to give a shit. Men are simple creatures. They <laughs> do not give a fuck. My wife. I'd be like, <laughs> I'd be like, yeah, it happens to the best of us. Where the bathroom was because I don't want them to think I was uh, weak and not a problem solver. Oh my God. Yeah, right? That's a lot to be yelling out. <laughs> That's good. Do they really, do they really pump that much air? So are you going to ask me out now? Oh my god. I love this. Yeah, I am. Wait, is this actually how it's going to work? I've been thrown. I did not think this is how it would happen. Oh, so they're going to be like fall in love, fall out of love, but then he's going to... Ew, wait, I'm already involved. I'm already like, I, I love it. This is, I mean, I'm, 
I'm I'm with it. Grilled cheese night? Ooh, I love a grilled cheese. For like five years. I got like six place on beam. Six place on beam. Out of got how many right. people? I'm impressed. I've been really good. I did gymnastics as a kid too. Beam was not my forte. Not a lot of it was my forte. But I did well enough. You just saw me take it off the burning. Oh, he's got a nice house too. Ew, they're really fucking attractive. Wait, they're having a conversation with her sitting on him like that? And they didn't fuck. Oh, they might have fucked. She's like, I need to be at my law degree, uh, my law practice firm. That's, the, that's where I'm an adult. I know things. Oh God, he got veins popping out of those arms. Is this gonna be me addicted to him for like the next two hours? Hour and 45? It is. <gasps> this is gonna be rough. I'm in love. Well, they just had a cute night on the couch. <gasps> <laughs> oh, that was, she is not good at, she's trying to sneak away. You either gotta pretend you're asleep or go, <gasps> you're gonna leave a note with your number? He's so attractive. Holly, I don't know. This guy is fucking great. Oh my gosh. Did you like- Oh my gosh! Yeah. He is great. Oh, you can wake up. I don't know why. Wh yeah, but ha Yeah, ha you don't know. Thank you. Go back! You. Bye. I'm, I'm so sorry. I oh my god. Supportive friends. Time, man. My boy's in love! Fuck that. I couldn't get her out of here fast enough. Oh no! She's a nothing. <gasps> oh! I think he was just saying that because he was... Oh... Oh, that's rough. I think he was just like, stop teasing me, but... No! It was so cute for a small amount of time. Barely. Wow, that's so random. Yes, it is. Wait, if you're looking to sneak out, I know that's your thing. Well, I am a disaster. Ooh, good. She had that strapped and ready to go. He didn't know she came back. I have to, Annie. It's just not right. Oh my God, is, gonna... I can bless this is it going to be a fake out? Without their friends and family joining us to celebrate. In Australia! We're in Australia! Oh, wow, that's a... It'll be summer there. It, December 22nd? I mean, great time to come, I guess, but over Christmas? Welcome on board, 2K. That seems kind of wild. 51E, how long's the flight? 16 hours. Yeah, no, you're screwed. The flight is rough. The fright is absolutely tough. 16 hours? It's just like to go anywhere <laughs> from Australia takes fucking forever. Welcome. Oh my god, wait, hold on. We've got Australia? I hope I can bust out some facts. Or probably not know anything about my own country. God. Claude told me you dumped him. Wait, Speak what? The wedding day. <gasps> oh my god. Anything from the front of the boat? He's going Coffee, there. I mask, pajamas, last 10 years of your life. Oh my lord. Maybe a cookie. Small thick and security. Nothing small about me. <gasps> what the fuck? <laughs> wow, that was like a lot, but I didn't mind it. It's good to know. I like it how they're presented as both good and both awful. Oh, she just easily cl No way everyone's asleep. That is not how a plane works. Thank you so much for joining me today on Hit There are definitely people that stay up and watch the, the movie channels. Hell yeah. She's like, everyone's asleep conveniently. I guess I'll have to. I did say you should get the cookie. <gasps> Oh my god, that was wild. And, well, 
he's awake. He has to be awake, right? Oh, she's still- <gasps> Oh my god, more than he bargained for. Oh, no. I'm sorry, you were getting woken up by that. <laughs> yeah. I see yourself, ma'am. We've got cookie-related problems going on over here. She's like, really? That's that's your choice? <laughs> oh my god, that was actually a really good scene. I liked it. Not uh, boss, are you? I am. Uh, it's always Sydney. <laughs> I'm sorry. Fucking Sydney. Get married somewhere else. At the same place? Yep. My stepdad's house. Oh, that's cool. I mean, personally, I'm like, you know, Melbourne's the best, but like... I feel like maybe if you're getting married, you go like Perth, like beautiful beaches, sunsets. I don't know. Just I'm like, it's always fucking Sydney. It's always Sydney. Anyone knows anything about Australia? It's fucking Sydney. <laughs> wow. Is her stepdad a bazillionaire? Because I know <laughs> things in Sydney, I wouldn't be in Sydney, but like that shit would not be cheap. Stranger, good to see you. I was hoping you'd come. Oh. I wanted to message you, but I didn't know how you the exact accent I was like ready for. Like, obviously, everyone's were like Australian. What did you think she's gonna sound? But, like, what sort of Australian? She had the exact <laughs> expect. Come meet my mate. My mate. Oh, you're fucked. Hi, mate. Wow, he is tall. We go back when, didn't we? Yep. Did you now? Good on ya. <laughs> uh, we're gonna go tropo this weekend. Can, can they? Okay, I don't think he could understand him. You know it. <laughs> they are some tight shorts. So I'm not mad about it. Yeah. Oh, Ben had no idea what he said. <laughs> Good on ya. I love the Australian representation. Okay, yeah. I'll be right out. <laughs> Am I going to be doing a crappy Australian accent this whole time? I'll just turn up my Australian accent so it sounds fake. Because there's my Australian accent and then there's like... You could really hear it Australian. They both look fantastic. Wow. I couldn't handle seeing those two together in person. Like, I think I just, like, spontaneously combust. Sign of the times. First word, the, a, of. Sign of the times is tough. For charades? No, just shut the fuck up. A woman, a woman. That was, that, that felt real. That was acting. Fireworks. Fireworks by Katy Perry. Yeah. Good on you. It's not fair. What? You're not. Are they gonna set that shit off indoors? Just do it. What is that? Oh, God. Oh Jesus, throw it! Oh, oh, Happy love! Nothing says love like burning shit down. Oh wait! Oh, don't throw it into the house! <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm glad she got it. Sorry. Yeah, are we gonna have to sit down meeting with you two? Apology and we'll now move on. Do wow. You know B's been in love with Ben since the first night they met. Oh my god, they're gonna trick each of them. Ego. Then why is he fighting with her? Well, because he likes her. Oh, this is so good. But does she know? Oh. Do they know? She might know, but he doesn't. I love how they just dropped. They just were like, we gotta get the fuck out of here. We scheming, motherfuckers. You. Oh. He turned the charm on. It got to you too. Oh, she knows. No. Really? No. It's Pete and Roger. <laughs> They're all in on it. <laughs> but you can't. Oh. <laughs> one who destroyed the living room. Would you do mind helping? Oh, me oh. what the mother? What the fuck? <laughs> what the mother? Sure. Holy yoish. Is she a ghost? She's not real. No one can see her but them. Alright, so everyone's involved in this. Yes. Are they gonna come up with a plan to be like, 
How about we just pretend to be in love to show them? Kathleen. Can you not swim? I'm an excellent swimmer. You look like you're struggling. Wow. How much further do you think? Are your eyes closed? <laughs> he is drowning. I am not out of shape. I've been to 295, 300 once. Okay. I just do cardio. Yeah, cardio is the devil. Okay. I'm not hot girl fit. <laughs> that, that's my dream to be hot girl fit. Wait. Wait. Can, can Wait. you help? Yeah, I need to get my cardio up. Oh, that's kind of cute, actually. If this movie's taught me anything. Do some cardio. Ugh. No, motivation? Okay, fine, I'll do some cardio. Hopefully. Maybe. Oh. I swear. What the fuck? Who, who, who's that quick at breaststroke? Is that breaststroke? She sees you with me. She wants what she can't have. And then bye bye, Crocodile Jack. Yeah. He's a lot. He's like, uh, what is he swimming like 75 fucking miles an hour? What is he, half fish? We're at a wedding a million miles away from home. No strings attached. We can hop under the cover of a masquerade. Oh my god. <laughs> She's doing this so well because I know it's a bit. It's still pretty amazing. Oh my word. He's fallen for it. Ooh. More of that. <laughs> He's like, yep, that was good. I am a dummy. He's like, I need help. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a useless himbo. <laughs> Please. I need more? I guess I could put it with the cousins. Why? <laughs> I love it. They're really cute. I'm happy the gays are doing well. The gays are doing well and strong, and that's all that's important in this movie. We don't care about <laughs> these two. Find the gap. How's that? That's good. Just like, but you don't have to hover. Just kind of... Oh, I'm, <gasps> I'm sorry. Okay, just take it out. Take it out? How did you get in there so quickly? Why are you in his asshole? You try. Oh, what? I stick my finger in my own ass. How is that going to convince... What? On you. Why are we just fingering each other's assholes? <laughs> in public? That's tight. Oh, see, it's like holding a baby bird. Oh my god. God damn it. They're all not looking in the slightest. Like a, a mole or something on your butt? No. <gasps> Is it gonna be a spider? <gasps> That's what more than a mole! What the fuck? Oh my god! Oh, he really got out! Oh, he's fully out! And he wasn't wearing underpants! Are there any more on me? <laughs> oh my god! No, I would freak out too. No one heard this? No. Pictures. Oh my god, that's hilarious. Where are they? I feel it! I feel it! Well, there's another one in his ass. What do you see? Oh. oh no, that's just a part of you. You're fine. Oh my god. I'm good. Yeah, you didn't have to... Yeah, throw them off the cliff. Into a tree. Oh! So, you look fantastic, I will say that. What we miss? Oh my word. Well, I reckon you could have just gone without the clothes. It would have been fine. Cheers, mate. I'll just grab a quickie. Oh, okay. okay. Oh! Okay. Oh, okay. Australia. What do you reckon, eh? How you um, finding it? Liking what I'm seeing, sir. What about you all the time? A ripper cunt, she calls you. <laughs> That's good. A ripper cunt is. A good friend. Good, yeah. You guys are really proud of your coffee here. We are. It's the best in the fucking world. Yeah, but not in Sydney. I'm just saying. <laughs> Melbourne's where it's at. Fuck, that is good. Yeah. You imagine what it would be like in Melbourne. Just saying. Just saying. Wow. Nice touch. Nice dress. That was a lot. They do. That was... That was so cool. <laughs> Why, oh, wow. I want to pick someone up out of a car, and I also want to be picked up out of a car. Sorry, where is this rehearsal? Ooh, seafood. 
Are we gonna do a King of the World? Titanic me. <gasps> oh, help you. Is he gonna drop her in the water? I don't know why, but I think that is how it's gonna go. Jack, I'm flying. Okay, oh my god. Stop there. <laughs> no, wait. It's kinda cute. What if they get together? And they're jealous. He's like, oh, we're done. Pushes. <laughs> oh my god. I knew what was gonna happen, but at least she can swim better than him. Throw, throw the- No! You're the bad swimmer! You meant to throw the floaty! I mean, he jumped straight in after her, which kind of really says something. Does it not? Especially when we know he is not as strong as her in the swimming department. Oh, but she's in a dress. That's actually probably hard to swim in. Why'd you jump in? To save you! But you're a terrible swimmer! <laughs> yeah, that's what I've been saying! Distances! Now no one knows we're overboard. Oh my god, it looks like they're going full Titanic. Hey, yeah. The commitment. <laughs> throw a door. Oh my god, yes, throw the manatee boyfriend in. He'll be there in a second and he could probably carry them both on his back. One on the back, one on his fucking giant schlong. Look at us. Bonding. Just a couple of fucked up people floating in the middle of the harbor. Yeah, not your average Thursday night, but you know, memorable. Get out alive, go see that from dry land. It's a pretty killer view from here. I, honestly, a great view. At night. Romantics jumping off of the moving train just to see the building with the person they love. Oh. Like your dad in the Eiffel. That's kind of sweet, actually. You, me, and the Opera House. It's a date. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait. Oh, he promised. It better happen. Am I? I'm full of them. Are they gonna kiss? Or it's Harbor Rescue gonna stop the kiss? <laughs> this is Harbor Rescue. <laughs> We're here to get you out of the water. Sorry that we cock blocked. <laughs> Didn't mean to. Oh my gosh. I think I'd be more scared of like fly like been dragged up into a helicopter <laughs> than I would on the boy. Oh wait, that's kind of like romantic though. It's like you're going to heaven together. Thank God Harbor Rescue can come so quickly too. He looks like he's gonna freak out. What's wrong? He's scared of heights. I'm a little afraid of flying. Oh. Big routine. Oh. My mask, headphones, build my yeah, I hate flying too. I get it. I am unwritten. Oh, is she gonna sing the song that he was listening to? Goodbye. That's my serenity song. Yep. How do you know? Wait, did he play that on loop for 16 hours? Wait, this is so cute. And they're over the opera house. You can almost taste it. Release your inhibition. Feel the rain. <laughs> okay, this is kind of good. They're building a good relationship between these two. I'm smiling a lot. I'm telling you, I'm a sap. I love a romance movie. It doesn't take a lot for me to fall for them, but they're doing it cute. The rest is at least they added it to the background. He's like, I'm gonna keep it in my mind and nothing else. Thanks, mate. <laughs> Thanks again. Stay out of the water, yeah? <laughs> that felt like the most Australian thing ever. Oh, okay. I thought we we're gonna get an interruption here. Is it gonna go well and then they're gonna find something to fight about? Oh. Or is the rest of this gonna be like real romance? Oh, they've really gone for it in this kitchen. Oh my god, in the family kitchen? I guess, you no, know, shouldn't anyone else, everyone else be like, 
coming to see that you're alive. Oh my god, his V line? Whoo! Holy shit. You could have run an irrigation system off that shit. Oh my lord, it's like an aqueduct. Everything I do just feels like a mistake. Well, that sounded horrible. That was really good to sound bad against him. <laughs> Overthinkers be like. It's real. You run away, call yourself a fuck boy, make an excuse, and you just move on to the next. Interesting. It's B. You jumped off a of boat for it. Yeah, I like how real you are with him. You need the friend that's just like, let's stop fucking around. Like, we're such an awful parent. <laughs> Mom, this isn't about you. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. We're not going to let you throw away your life because you're going okay. to do something. Okay, the helicopter is strong with you two. Fucked it up. Oh you my god. Fuck I fucked it up? Yeah, you fucked it up. Doggy, run! Oh, oh, no. oh, oh. Bad dog, Oh no! I am so sorry. Wait. Why would that be your f- Oh, fuck it up. Fuck it up! Fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up! That's the word for it to grab the fox. But that ain't on them, come on. Let's be real here. No, parents, helicopter parents are a lot. I get it. Like, I understand their love and they want the best. It's not like, you know, it's definitely not the worst way parents can go. But, you know, people have to figure out their own lives. And, like, their decisions is... Their decisions is... Their decisions are made for what they think is best. And sometimes it can only be what you pick to make you happy. You gotta go for yourself, like... I don't know, it can't be anyone else. You gotta, you gotta steer your own life. I have been so stressed, and you've been more worried about what's going on with B than with me. Yeah. Concerned about your planning, are you marrying me or your IQ? Oh no, they're fighting, not the gays! Well, if that's how you feel, then why are we even doing this? Yeah, you gotta go to B and get you and her to apologize to them, even though it wasn't really all your fault, and to make them have a great weekend. I don't know what Margaret's boyfriend is giving, but he's given, like, the Australian Bachelor, or, like, Bachelorette, or, like, Farmer Wants a Wife. I don't know if that's a show anywhere else, but it's a dating show in Australia, Farmer Wants a Wife. It's... it's interesting. Aw, the ring bearer dog. That's very adorable. I now pronounce you married! Hell yeah. Oh my god. The cliff does make me a little worried. Like, there's something about it that I'm scared. Wait, he plays the... Cello? <laughs> I don't know. I'm not a music guy. I don't know what those things are called. <laughs> they can't not meddle. It is it is the way of our people. We can't not meddle. These few days really made me realize how much I miss you. When seeing you with someone else? No, we won't. No. I love you, but it's yeah. our wedding. You guys are meant to be having fun. Yeah. I might go and do some people watching. Sounds good. These people. Yeah, the person you might kind of like. Thank you. And happy wedding. Oh, but he pulled away from that. Ben. He didn't feel it. He didn't feel it like he did with B. Oh, look, we're up the up in Bondi Beach. <laughs> oh, I feel as an Australian that hurt me. When Americans say it like that, Bondi Beach, obviously. I feel like I have to. I have to say. It. Oh wow. You're doing more than people watching. You're leaving. You're getting the fuck out of the country. She's like, take me to the airport. I don't want my stuff. Oh my god, that's... <laughs> it's like... I get it, babe. But it's like... Like the taxi driver's just gonna be like... Mm, yikes. 
to walk around, do some people watching. That's what she said. People watching. I yeah. think it was more of a. Oh, she she's gone to the opera house. It's not. I think I know where she might be. Yeah. Okay. Go get her. Scour the city, block by block. Scan the grid. It's not a grid, actually. I know exactly where she is. No, oh, well, that makes it a lot. Sydney's easier. actually a lot worse laid out. Doesn't have a nice grid formation there, city. It's more of a train. Melbourne, I'm just saying, very nicely okay. laid out. I'm just, oh. I'm just putting it there. Oh my god, he can do cardio? Oh! I knew someone was getting off that cliff! Oh my god, he's jumped in the ocean twice for her. Oh my god, father, do not. That was like a fairly long cliff to dive off. Like, rather impressive. Is he gonna like know them by name now? They're like, didn't we see you last night? Hey, <laughs> he has like a punch card. They're like, one more and <laughs> we honestly just leave you because <laughs> we can't keep doing this. Oh, I was like, I thought they were going to like lower him down slowly in front of her. Okay, this is a little bit better. Why don't you just pick people up by phone? You still get the girl. <laughs> She's like, wait, we're really sick of your shit, mate. Oh my god. Wait, that's kind of everything though. Jumping out of a helicopter and running for you? Okay, he's not going to propose, but this looks like it would be a proposal boxes if I'm not the one. I get it. That would really, really fucking suck. Also, how could you say no to that? Look at him. Fucking green eyes. Whew. So you're gonna kiss me now? <laughs> I like, she's in command. I am. I need to look up the ages because the whole, the old joke, I need to know how old he is because he looks stunning. I feel like he's not aging as rapidly as I am. For Mr. No Cardio. Yeah, I'm dying. It's a mare. Oh. They had a lot of good, like, little callbacks in this movie, which I really enjoyed. Oh, wait, this is so cute. <laughs> they should get together. Wait, you get a banana? You get rescued by Harbour Rescue? Okay, that is- it's hard to see those two together without shirts. That's a lot. I'm sorry you almost called off your wedding because of all of our bullshit. Yeah. I saw you arguing on the porch. Oh, no, 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 we staged a fake fight so you guys would feel bad and make up. <laughs> Itinerary or me? Well, if that's how you feel- I They're so good. What the fuck? Thank you very much. Puppets. We're just- yeah, they played you and me. Oh my god. And then just dumb, we got played. <laughs> they just like, they're like, this is the worst movie we've ever worked on. They have only constantly played this song in the background and we have had no peace for four months. That was a cute little ending, actually. That was a cute little movie. That was a sweet movie. I liked it. I love a rom-com every now and then. I was in it. I was like, they are very hot. And also, they wrote it well. I liked it. If, like, they had things and they made things come back around. And they're like, yes, like, we're going to we're gonna set this up. And we're going to have it come back. And a lot of good little jokes and a lot of bits. The fighting was, like, dumb. And you're like, oh, just, like, communicate and stuff. But it's, like, the perfect, like, cheesy dumbness that you need for a rom-com. It, like, works in these, like... If this, you know, it's in like one of those like teen high school shows, you're just like annoyed because you're like, just shut the fuck up and communicate. But in like a rom-com movie like this, you're like, yeah, it makes sense and it's fun and it, it drives the plot, which is great. I don't know. And it was great to see Australia. I mean, all fucking Sydney, of course, but like, you know, represent the accent got thrown around. I'm sorry for my horrible accent. Um, I mean, I'm allowed to do it badly because it's, it's just the heightened version of the one I got, but... 
I know it was still rough to hear, so formal apology. <laughs> but yeah, it was a really cute movie. I don't know, it was just... It's one of those ones. There's there's not anything to look into it. There's no deeper thing. It was just a fun movie. I really enjoyed it. It was a good rom-com. Like, I think they did it very well. And yeah, it was just... It was like one of those ones where you just have a good time watching it and it's just heaps of fun. And it really was. And then, like, they were fun acting. The chemistry was good. I don't know. I'm going to be in a good mood for the rest of the day. So it did its job. Uh, but yeah, I, I hope you enjoyed and are having a great day. And I hope to see you in the next one.